The Memphis Group was founded in the 1980s by Ettore Sozzas as a group of Italian designers and architects. They were mostly known for their colorful and extreme designs, a mix of 1950s styles as Art Deco, Pop Art and Kitsch. They use a vibrant chromatic palette, such as primary, neon or pastel colors. In the Memphis style predominates the use of asymmetric geometry and anarchic patterns, repetitive and bold. We're going to create the Memphis style with a pattern in which we're going to use repeated geometric shapes and the pastel palette. We can either go for a palette that's true to the original or go for a muted one if we want something more contemporary. Even if we deviate a bit with the figures or the color palette from the original, the key to Memphis style is to be bold. The first thing we're going to do after we did some research on the Memphis style is going to be the sketches. We're going to create a new file, A4 size, with a 150 dpi in color. With this kind of style we can just start drawing shapes and have fun with it, as long as we keep in mind what we already learned about this specific style. We're going to create 3 or 4 sketches with different shapes and before choosing the final one we're going to try them with a color palette as color is very important in this style. Depending on what we want to achieve with a pattern, we can choose different kinds of palettes. If we want to stick to the classic Memphis style, we can go for very bold colors, or if we want something more fresh, we can use more muted tones. In this case, we're going to be using a more pastel palette, but in case you want to stay true to the original, you could use a companion color pick to extract a color palette from one of the original Memphis group's furniture designs or any other design whose palette you want to emulate. I'll show you how to use the color pick next. We're going to use the color pick from the companion on our mobile app to create our color palette. We need to have the app on our phone and have Clip Studio Paint open in both our phone and our computer. Next, we're going to click on this icon. We'll open the app on our phone, click on the same icon and scan the QR on our computer screen. Now both our phone and computer are connected. We can now take a picture of whatever we want and the companion is going to extract the color palette of that image. If we double click over the color, it will appear on our computer screen. We can also go to our folder and upload the picture. That is going to be helpful if, as I said before, we want to extract the color palette from an image of some real Memphis style. Now that I have a vase from a palette, I'm going to choose only some of the colors showing on the image and I'm going to create a palette using color set. The next thing I'm going to do is grab the sketches and try different combinations with my colors creating different thumbnails to choose the final design I want to create.
In the next video, I will show you how to create a seamless pattern.